Hi there, once again welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create this amazing text effect in Photoshop. So this is going to be a text through an object using Photoshop. So you can see anywhere I drag this particular text, it's going to look as if this text is actually going through this object. So remember to subscribe if today is your first time visiting my channel. And don't forget to turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorials. If you check this, I use the same strategy to achieve this and then the same strategy for this as well so once you master the techniques i'm going to show you you can implement this on any object you want to so let's jump into action and see how to do this the first thing i need to do is that i want to first clear this and then work with just a background image so i'm just going to drag this and drop it here in order to delete it so we first have to select this particular object that's the night over here so we're going to go to sub we're going to go to select then go to the subject and it's going to select this like foot for us so now this has been selected and what i need to do is to create a duplicate of the selection press ctrl plus j on your keyboard in order to get a duplicate now we want to write the text so go to your tools and select the horizontal type to select that and i'm going to type like i want all in caps so make sure cap is on and then i'll go ahead and use the move tool just reposition this and actually enlarge this a bit so i'll go to the edges and drag this out in order to increase the size of my selection okay if you want to rotate this you can just bring your cursor to the edges and just rotate it a bit that's cool now what i want to do is that i'm going to drag this text below my object so the duplicate of the object i had i'm going to drag this below that now i also want a duplicate of this text so in order to do that I'm going to press ctrl plus j and you can see i have a duplicate of this text and i'll actually drag it on top of this object like this and then i will now right click and then go towards convert so i'm going to convert this into smart object now from here what i'm going to do is i want to open the layer style and then from the layer style menu i'm going to make sure my show opacity here it's completely what is zero so you can see i'll move it to zero you may not see the second text but the first text is below now in order to make the second text appear i'll go to the stroke option and then i'll make sure i turn on the stroke so the minute i add a stroke you can see i have my next selected i can actually increase the size of this stroke and you see what is happening so i'll just increase the size of this stroke lightly and if you want to add a shadow you can equally do that you can see i've actually added a shadow to this now i just click on ok there's a lot you can do with this so when i select this two there's two like i made a copy of that so if i start moving this around you can see it's actually going to shift to any part of this object anywhere i select or anywhere i move this to like subscribe for more tips and tricks in photoshop to so see how this is going to work this is even even easy with this one if i delete my pizza and i want to do the same thing i can just use my horizontal type to just type pizza on this so pizza and that is all i will just go ahead and then just enlarge this so with this i'm actually not going to do any copy just confirm this and what i'll do is that i'll rather make sure the fill color i don't even need to go to the blend mode the fill color here is 100 percent i'll just switch it towards zero and you can see nothing is showing at the moment but we can double click on the pizza and then make sure we just add a stroke to that and you can see what is happening it is actually going to show like this you want to add a shadow to that we want to drop shadow we can equally do that if you want to increase the stroke you can do that as well so you see what is happening anyway i move this object to it's going to take the shape of that so this is how to create this simple texture effect in photoshop like subscribe for more of my video and also don't forget to comment at the comment section of this particular video till i come here again bye bye